Okay. So here we are, question number nine. And it's a little bit tricky, so we've got to keep our wits about. So the first thing we know is we see this density. So we remember that density is mass divided by volume. So we know that one meter cubed of B has a mass of 8,600. So if we consider the ratio A to B to C, 13 to 15 to 21. So if we consider B, if we consider the density of B, of what they've given us, of the one meter cubed, the density is their mass, 8,600 divided by one, which is 8,600 kilograms per meter cubed. So we know that B represents the, these 15 parts of this ratio. So if I take the 8,600, so well, first of all, that was the density of B, wasn't it? If I take the 8,600 and I divide it by 15, I get 573.3 repair. So that's how much one part is worth. So, uh, so these are the, uh, if I multiply each of these by 573.3, so if I consider the A first, that's 13 times uh, 573.3, comes out as 7,453.3 recurring. In the ratio to, well, we know that B is worth 8,600, these are the densities, and we know that C is going to be 21 times this number, which comes out as 12,040. So we want to work out the difference in the mass of the thing. So these all, this, all of this here is to do with density. The ratio is to do with density, so we found the density of B, and then we use that to find the densities of A and C. If I want to find the mass, of A, I'm going to have to use a slightly different form of this. I'm going to rearrange this and I'm going to say that mass is the density times the volume. So the mass of A is going to be, the answer here, 7,453. And if you're worried about the three recurring, you can do it on your side of the calculator or do this calculation times it by the 13, but then we're going to multiply by 5, because there is 5 metres cubed. So the mass times the volume of A, so there's 5 lots of that. And it comes out as 37,266.6 recurring. And if this is the mass, it's in kilograms. If we do the same thing to find out the mass of B, remember we only know the density from up here, so it's 8,600 divided by 15 times the 21, which is the, or not B, C, 12,040 times by how much is 3 metres cubed of C, and that comes out as 36,000. 125. So if we do a calculation, if we take uh, the mass of C and we, uh, well let's do the maths in that way around because mass of A is bigger. The mass of A minus the mass of C, so we're doing this number to write and subtract this number, we we'll come up with 1,100 and 46.6 recurring and the difference is in kilograms 
So we need to round this to three significant figures. So it's 1,150. One, one, that's, that's six. Three significant figures, that's six is going to round four to five. So 1,150.